Hi. This is my room. Well, technically, uh, it sucks. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. I don't want to vlog. Let's just fucking get this over with. This is my room. My brother sleeps there, and I sleep there. Soon, I'll sleep over there because my brother is going to boot camp. He is joining the United States Marine Corps and he'll be leaving, he leaves Sunday and he starts Monday. So as you can see, this, this whole place is um, kind of a wreck because we're just getting everything put away. There's just, there's just a lot of stuff that, that he has to go through. He's lived in this room his entire life, his entire life. And well, yeah. Yeah, kinda. Most of his life. The majority of his life. Like 90% of his life. He's lived here. In this room. Crazy. So, there's a lot of things that my brother's, like, found so far that's been like, Oh, I remember having this. Oh my god. Oh, like, his, uh, we have his, his violin that he found. He found, like, a bunch of, like, Deadpool comics. Which some, actually, he recently bought. Uh, th that's all my stuff. I was being an adult and getting everything situated he's just got like a bunch of stuff i let him have this box obviously because he doesn't have a kid and he's got a really nice video game collection but it's okay even though i do have an xbox i do not have an xbox one or the new xbox one x or the playstation 4 i don't do consoles anymore i stick to pc so yeah this is um this is what the damage looks like here's a hint that that he was really willing to go into the marine corps Aww, how cute! What are my thoughts about my brother going into the Marines? Well, damn. You really want to get into that? Mm, okay. Let's get out of this room. Here's a here's another preview of the room without the GoPro, which I should probably charge. So, the military in general. We're not just speaking of Marines, Navy, Army, and that's it because the Coast Guard doesn't count. Most of you guys know that I was in the military myself. I served in the United States Navy, I was first stationed in Virginia, where I was on board the USS, the USS Nassau, LHA-4. I'm not gonna bother getting into what the hell any, the LHA means and all that. If you really care, you're gonna look it up on your own. I did some time and I feel as if I experienced quite a few things. Thanks to the Navy, thanks to the things that the Navy provided, and like I said, military in general. So for him to join the Marine Corps, even for somebody in the Navy, even if for someone in the Army or Coast Guard, whatever, I'm pretty sure we all agree that Marines are probably are probably a little more hard ass than than the rest. Yeah, I don't know. I've I've met some I've met some good ones and some bad ones. I mean, there's there's all kind. The diversity of the United States military is just tremendous. If there's one thing to expect if you join is people from all races. I'm I'm excited. I'm excited, overall excited for my brother to, to learn something new and to experience these things and be able to get out there because I feel that as people, the people that we are, the people that we turn into, cultivate ourselves, I feel like that happens through knowledge and experience. If he goes to school while he's there, he's gonna get that knowledge awesome. And he's gonna get, be getting some knowledge regardless. But most of all that experience is what's gonna, what's gonna really, really set the bar for what he thinks he is about. He's gonna see things out there that are gonna completely change his mind. He has an idea. And even though I haven't gone too specific in detail when I tell him stories of when I was in the service, he has a small idea of what to expect yet no one ever really sees it coming and you can ask anyone that's been in the military if if they thought they would see the things that they've seen before they even joined or the moment they started or it's crazy it's it's very it's very rewarding and pretty honoring to have served alongside other people that shared shared a common goal and not everybody was there because they loved america and they wanted to kill terrorists a lot of people I knew there were there because they they wanted to get assistance for school. They wanted to help their families. Um, just an unbelievable amount of reasons, all bringing them honor and courage for that commitment that they've made. 
to the military. So the fact that my brother's one of them, it makes me feel proud. It, it really does. So I'm excited for that to happen. So pretty much summarizing this whole thing, I'm glad little bro is making changes. He's, uh, he's growing up. He's making big boy decisions to do this. So fuck yeah. Go him. Now, um, he leaves in a day and a half. I'm gonna call off work tomorrow. Hopefully I don't get fired. Here's to hoping. And then, we're probably gonna go to the beach or something, so stay tuned. Um, short little vlog today. Don't wanna take much of you guys' time. I just wanted to put this out there because it's kind of a, it's kind of a big thing. I remember when I was leaving, everyone kind of made it a big thing. So, you know, I want him to know he's, he's gonna be missed.